Hello everyone, have you seen the process of repairing a roller drum? It will be very interesting, let's find out with me in this video. The first roller was brought to the place of these talented workers. These guys are turning screws to see if they can get the roller wheel out. Can see a lot of snails right. Finally the two claws were removed, the workers worked together to lift it to one side. Next, move the drum outside and see what they used. You have to admit, they are experienced workers. Continue working on the rear roller wheel, I hope this is not the first time they have done this, look at their coordination. Each roller wheel is brought to the repair shop, here they don't need a forklift, what they need is a head of intelligence and solidarity. The car is raised 10 centimeters above the stone surface to continue the next step. Using rotations combined with a rudimentary tool, they were able to clean the surface of the roller wheel. This guy is one of the skilled craftsmen, look at how he delivers the knife smoothly, so smooth. These are like a complete transaction. Truly a professional hand, they feel it with their hands. Marked and continued with hammer blows. Still this guy I see him doing a lot of steps and now welding metal. Realign and continue the rotations. The lathe is then mounted, and does its job. With the naked eye we can see that the roller wheel is very warped. The manager said, if you can't do it, come out and watch me do it. With his experienced hands and eyes, the first metal shavings were shaved off. Look, the drum seems to be quite warped. The lathe knife is also very worn out due to overwork. The new tool is replaced and work continues. Steel shavings are constantly removed. On this side, the workers are still very young. Life is hard and they have to go to work at a very young age. He doesn't need protection for his hands. Next comes the cutting and welding stage, look at the protective gear they don't even need, what a reckless bunch of guys. The device is modified into. I guess they have done it many Tim. The measuring tool is also the crudest diagram. Notice this guy, he does a lot of work, he must be very well paid. The welds are very nice, followed by the process of grinding away the excess. It seems that the work is almost finished, people are doing it quickly. Many people watch to make sure there are no mistakes. Many people watch to make sure there are no mistakes. Many people watch to make sure there are no mistakes. The final step still has to be done by the manager, his eyes can replace any measuring tool. Look at this achievement, even without any modern tools they still completed it perfectly. What a masterpiece. He tested it with his hand and was extremely satisfied.